From Cincinnati Children's Hospital could help kids with asthma. And joining us now with how it could help children and families living with this disease, health anchor Liz Bonus. Liz. Hey guys, good afternoon to you. Scientists at Cincinnati Children's are part of a team and they released a new tool this week. They conducted research using local children to find out that this tool may actually predict asthma in young children in ways previously not possible. Asthma is a condition where the lungs sort of seize up and make it hard to breathe. This new tool is a decision chart, so to speak, that appears to help medical providers and parents pick up signs of the disease often missed by previous diagnostic tools. Researchers refer to this tool as PARS, or Pediatric Asthma Risk Score. They expect that by adding up identifiers, everything from early wheezing to allergic rhinitis to food allergies, mild to moderate cases of asthma could be predicted and perhaps even prevented. A study published in the online journal of allergy and clinical immunology found PARS is more accurate at predicting mild to moderate asthma than some previous discovery tools used. Now this tool was developed by looking at more than 700 infants in Cincinnati and Northern Kentucky. They considered whether or not their parents had asthma and then followed followed up with those kids as they grew up at regular intervals. They used skin testing and other methods and then found that the kids with asthma by the age of seven not only had a parent with it more likely, but they also were more likely to have some food allergies, have other problems such as eczema, have wheezing at a young age, and have you know that allergic rhinitis, we call it the Cincinnati sinuses, as well as be African American. If you want to check out this tool, see if your child might be at risk, we have it for you. You can look at it at local12.com. Guys, 